about to apply it to my face and they say um, in three days that all of this this is how I look now without makeup um, I just took a shower so everything is fresh I just washed my face they say in three days all of that will be gone yeah I don't believe that a lot neither so I'm gonna give it a month one month instead of three days I normally do three months but since they say three days I'm gonna just go ahead and give it a month and I'll just show my progress so this is how it looks I put it on um, the ice box yes I do still say ice box I'm not about to change it just because I'm on YouTube so this I <laughs> this is how it looks it's the foamy like it doesn't smell bad or weird or anything I'm just scared how cold it is because it's been in an ice box since I've been in the shower. So, let's start applying. Let's go. It's, it is cold. It's not going on like I thought it was like a mask, a paste. Maybe I need to add more. It looks like oatmeal, kind of. So, maybe I just need to pack it on instead of rubbing it in. But one thing, I got the wrong brush. I'm going to just pack it on the area that I really needed the most, like on my cheek area. And definitely my chin. And that part is really sensitive because I have little hairs that I pick at. And I pick my skin also with the tweezers. So it's, I know that's bad, but that's why my chin looks terrible. So if you know a way that I can get rid of um, facial hair, let me know. Comment down. Let me know because your girl can't be going out looking like this. And I want this to be clear up really fast. Oh, you're leaving on for um 20 minutes, they said. So that's what I would do. It's not that bad, and I'm glad it doesn't smell. Try like everything in the book to get rid of this, and nothing seems to work. So now I'm trying this. We will see. We shall see. And I just gotta stay consistent with it, because usually I'm not. I'm so impatient. And I have oh and it's very messy so if you're going to try this please be in the bathroom or in an area where you don't you don't mind stuff just wasting everywhere see it just wastes again this feel like it's about to waste a drop and I'm just taking little scoops and stuff and just picking it up and I will keep it stored in the ice box. And hopefully this will last me for a month if it doesn't change colors or anything. So keep an eye on that too. So hopefully this will last me, last me. Like if not, I bought a bag of potato and I just need to get another lemon. Okay, that spot burns. Like I said, I do pick with that. And it's hard for me to stop them testing up because it burns. But if you don't have, um, like, if you don't pick with your skin like I do, it, it won't burn. Because nothing else burns. It's just in that area. Oh, it's going everywhere. So, yeah. Please be in your bathroom or in a place where you don't mind it falling everywhere. It's all with a fresh face. Make sure I cover all of my dark spots that I want to get rid of. I don't really have nothing over there. Like, ooh, it's burning. Just a chin area, just a chin area. I'm okay. I will survive this. It's my own daggone fault anyway. Maybe I shouldn't have put it in my lip because I'm starting to taste it. Ugh. And it doesn't taste pretty good. Tastes terrible. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think I'm almost done. I'm gonna just smooth it out a little bit. My 
have no problem area again is to my cheeks my chin and basically that's it but it's horrible it stands out I mean that's all I'm saying that's it but it's horrible and then I have oily skin on top of that so the shine yeah it really doesn't mix Yep, and I think I'm gonna end it right there. So this is what it ugh, still tasted in my mouth is terrible, you guys. So I think I'm gonna end it like this and wait the 20 minutes and I'll tell you my experience within those 20 minutes. So so yeah guys, um within the 20 minutes that I let it sit on my face, I noticed that it was getting tight and stiff. But not so much as where it was uncomfortable. It was comfortable, but that's how it felt. It was getting tight and stiff. So when I went to wash it off, it is kind of hard to get off, but nothing um, a little warm water can fix. And just keep wiping it off until all the stuff is off your face. And basically, I like the feeling. It didn't burn or nothing. It wasn't too uncomfortable, like I say, even though it did get stiff and kind of um tighten. But um, I think that was the lemon that was doing that, actually. But so far, yeah, I don't think I'm going to um, put anything else like a moisturizer over it. I'm going to bed now. I don't think I'm going to use a, um, a moisturizer. But if you did this before and you think I should or... Um, you have like um if you can give me an idea of what to use after if i should or should not just leave a comment below and just let me know and i will post back on this diy home mask with lemon and potatoes and i will let you guys know so just leave your comments don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button and let me know Okay, thank you guys for watching it. And I forgot to mention too that they say do it twice a day. So this is my first day using it and I'm and I did it at night. So I'm gonna do it in the morning. And so far and it has my face soft and smooth. So we'll see. Okay, bye.